that I get to present to Ted Hope the Trailblazer Award from the 2009 Woodstock Film Festival. <laughs> That, that was uh, kind of mind-blowing. <laughs> so, but it's 60 films, 60, not 50. <laughs> but he wrote that at dinner right before we got here, so uh, hire him for your speechwriter. Um, I, I'm just really honored to, to uh, you know, get to join all of you at this uh, great celebration of film and music and community. Um, <clears throat> I'm choked up. I want to truly thank uh, Mira and Laurent and, and Nikki and all the volunteers here and the sponsors for making this happen um, and for making all the festivals happen because um, we wouldn't have events like this if it wasn't for you, so thank you. Um, can you. Can you imagine this world of ours without events like this one? Without films like the movies that are screened here? Um, I can, so I know that you can, because it hasn't been that long that we lived without it. And uh, that could happen again, I think, really easily. You know, um, I have been called many things in my life. Um, it's nice to be called Trailblazer tonight. Um, you know, I, 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 I work probably too hard, you know, um, but it's been a, a real privilege to get to make the films that I have uh, and with the directors that I, I've got to work with and the crews that I've got to work with and the actors I've got to work with. Um, but I have dreams of uh, probably making many more films with even better teams of people and, and really getting to work now with the really engaged audiences uh, in the years ahead. My, my drive to get this done comes from being able to remember when I didn't have those opportunities that I do now, the opportunities not just to make such work but, and not just even to see such movies, but particularly to, to discuss the, these films, to participate in them in a thing that, you know, is that incredible experience, uh, that shared thing that brings people closer together. My, my drive to keep making more movies comes from not wanting that opportunity to be missed by myself or by any of you. I like to think that getting this honor tonight uh, comes from my commitment to truth, you know, both in terms of content and in terms of process. You know, a commitment to emotional and experiential truth, you know, to the portrayal of our world um, in, in a way that doesn't diminish or denigrate or speaks down to, you know, any audience, but instead portrays us um, in the ways that we recognize, you know, that this expansive nature and, and deep community that defines all of us. Lately, though, when I've, uh, you know, when people come to talk to me about trailblazing, you know, it happens so much, right? It's, uh, it, it's not because of the, the, the work that I've done in the past or the films I made or any innovations I've got to be part of. It's because of what I've been doing uh, in this past year when I haven't been able to make movies. It's about uh, what I've been doing because I'm, I'm actually really afraid that we might all uh, lose this glorious and diverse and ambitious film culture. You know, the community that's blossomed, uh, you know, over the last two decades, both here at Woodstock and all over the globe. I, I really do fear that we might, might lose that community and the opportunity that's right before us now to evolve it into a, a true force for social change if we don't start to act in some new ways. You know, people think of art form as, uh, film as an art form and movies as entertainment. Um, <coughs> a uh, independent producer from, a <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> from an earlier area, earlier era, Walter Wanger, um, spoke of movies as ambassadors culture ambassadors, but uh, in my experience, I've always felt they're much more like community organizers, something I'm proud to have been one once. And I was going to work for ACORN, but uh, 
I went to work for someone else. But, you know, it's always just amazed me that movies' abilities to, to bring us together, expand our horizons, you know, encourage our dreams, all those things, you know, recognize our commonalities, motivate our actions, ignite our passions, to unite us as a community. As, you know, movies' power to do that is really unrivaled, but it's really rarely unleashed. And I, I can't even begin to tell you, like, how charged up I've been lately about the potential that's there. And I don't want to squander it. <laughs>